हेलो फ्रेंड वी आर डूइंग फंक्शंस ऑफ बेसल गैंगलिया एंड इट इज पार्ट टू इन द पार्ट वन प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव डन फाइव फंक्शंस ऑफ पोटाम सर्किट इन दिस वी आर डूइंग फंक्शन ऑफ कॉर्डिएट सर्किट दिस इज कॉम्पिटेंसी नंबर पी वाई टेन पॉइंट सेवन एज इन द पोटाम सर्किट वी हैव डन पी फॉर पी पोटाम सर्किट इज फॉर पॉस्चर हियर फॉर कॉर्डिएट सर्किट वी कैन यूज अ न्यूमोनिक सी फॉर सी दैट इज कॉर्डिएट सर्किट is for cognitive control of motor activity we can understand quadrate circuit like this it's a loop connection between cortex and basal ganglia via caudate nucleus but no fiber is going to putamen and then through thalamus the fibers are returning back this circuit is specially involve inputs as well as outputs from these association areas which are areas for higher function or areas for planning and programming especially if the person come across a difficult and new situation what motor activities or the movement should be planned and at what sequence for example if say a dangerous animal or a snake comes in front of a person he may decide to turn away and run so these two activities are decided and the sequence is first turning away then running so this all is decided by quadrate circuit its second function of quadrate circuit is it controls timing and scaling of motor movement means how large the movement should be and how quick the movement should be for example suppose somebody is writing on blackboard is maybe the font or the size of letters while say the same person is writing on the paper of course font size will be much less speed also is decided so as per situation timing and scaling is decided and it's a function of caudate circuit third important function is along with posterior parietal lobe caudate circuit do orientation of body and body parts in the space and that's why if one side caudate circuit is lesion say right caudate circuit the person will not do any activity on the left side for example suppose a painter is painting the face and say one sided caudate circuit is lesion possibly he will paint only one side opposite side activity will be totally ignored no movement will be planned so he would be painting only one side so these three are the main function of caudate circuit but c for c caudate circuit is for cognitive control this holds the key